All right, when we left off, this strange woman was inviting me into, the, into my house, into their house. Which I guess might have been because I'm dressed like this. I mean, basically flagging, so why wouldn't you? Hi. Come. Glad to see you, friend. So, what say you? Would you care to live here in my absence? As I've said, you needn't worry about tending to the place. Many thanks, friend. I knew I could count on you. I'll stop by again in a week's time, but till then, farewell. The fuck is happening? We will find much better rest in an abode than out in the elements, methinks. Let us make good use of it while we can. Why would someone just be like, move into my house? I guess there was house sitting or something? Withdraw? Okay, the items I put in here are still here. That's good. Aged. Oh god, I put fish in here. Might have not been the smartest move ever. Warm side crystal. It's just... It's not my inventory. I've got too much crap in my inventory and it's get this game really punishes you for weights. This game punishes you enough for a weight that I'm I've literally handed my chest piece to Leon so I don't have to carry it. Okay. So I guess the purpose of this place is just to give you like a bed. A good so sleep will ensure we are prepared for the morrow. Uh-huh. Thank you for explaining sleep to me, Leon. Your pawn has returned from beyond the rift. Ooh, somebody used them. Travel together day and night, completed first pawn quest. Okay. RC received. He's gotten three heart. He's gotten three thumbs up and a heart. He's been used three times. It was a satisfying journey filled with new discoveries. I fought many battles, and not once did I lose my edge. I have learned much, both from my successes and my failures. Okay. New equipment from artisans? What did I get? What do you mean, equip? They gave me rotten meat! Dude! I thought I might be stingy, giving people, like, a crafted potion. Only one person gave me a crafted potion. People, Two people gave me an apple, one of them gave me rotten meat. Man, fuck y'all. <laughs> Fuck you, Shoshan. Grim, Makoto, Shoshan, and Parnet. Why is that one? Hang on a minute. What does that icon mean? Does that mean they're my friend? I don't know who Gift Giver is. Oh, his name is Gift Giver. Who is Grim? I don't know, because it's their like character name, I, su I assume. So I just don't know who, oh, can I click view profile? I can find out who this person is. Oh yeah, they're on my friends list. It's the same person whose pet, whose uh, companion I used earlier. It gave me a fucking apple. How dare you? Enter pawn badge acquire item. What, what, what? Uh, def defeat Cyclops? Oh my God. Defeat Ogre, defeat Griffin. Defeat the Minotaur. Captain Vernon, that sounds boring. Uh, I guess just focus on Cyclops, just get a badge done and become good at it. I guess, well, I guess I should say defeat Griffin, because that's an enemy I haven't defeated yet normally. So I would like for you to be good at it. Reward four other players. Oh. You can like give a cash reward for helping out. I don't have much money on me right now though. This is so hard to control. I'm just trying to make it exactly a hundred, a thousand. Yeah. <clears throat> 
There we go. It was a certain sorcerer who left the deepest impression. Never have I seen such nimble use of magic. Good morrow, everyone. Off we go then. Main pawn's travelogue. That's just what we're doing. Okay, it's just a tutorial, but it's not the actual travelogue. Anyway. Rested, I trust. Um. Okay. Clear obligation to Mildred by frequenting her dwelling for a week. Okay. I just have a bunch of hang out and go to places sometimes quests, which is interesting. I don't have a staff for that person, so I guess we'll just ignore that for now. Let's do the one of investigate the false sovereign. That's like over here. And it's just off to the right-ish. Don't really have a way of traveling that quickly, so we're just gonna go. I overheard some of the soldiers standing guard outside the palace discussing a curious rumor. Oh, did it pertain to the Queen Regent and an important personage, for chance? Oh, hi. So my sustain is yours to me. You have my protection. I'm trying to figure out how to leave. You want to end it right when it finishes charging because that makes it do a super charge. Oh. Hey, I toppled him. It looks fucking cool. Oh my god, I tore him apart. That health is gone. <laughs> Oh, it's not dead yet. It has another health bar. Whoops. Come back here. Ooh, fall over. Yes, big hit. Head hits are no joke. You hit Y on the head and it's over. Just climbing over the body. One of my favorite things about this game is it seems to have no... Hey, buddy. It seems to have no durability. Durability is just annoying. <laughs> it's just annoying in every video game. Just don't. Just don't do it. Not unless it's, at least not unless you're doing something more Zelda-y where it's about losing items permanently all the time and having to improvise and switch through them. Like, durability makes more sense in like, at least from what I remember, in like, Condemned. The game where you beat people up with a bunch of melee weapons. And they break and you're like, oh, I gotta find a new pipe. You're like worrying about whether or not you have enough melee weapons to survive all the hobos you're fighting. That was a real sentence. I did find Condemned very effective. It 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 was reasonably scary, especially its final level when I was like a teenager. I looked back at it now and I'm like, oh god, the 360 era has aged worse than any other era of 3D visuals. Like older video games look better than the 360 games do. 360 games are so ugly. We ran into this with with Silent Hill, where we got to we played through the Xbox era. Which is like PS2 era, and it's like, this is fine. Pretty, even. Then you get to like Silent Hill, I think, Homecoming, the, the 360 one. And you're like, that's a terrible console generation visually. They're such ugly video games. Something about the lighting. The 
and the blobbiness of people. Overconfidence is an enemy in and of itself. Games were like a little too sure of themselves with how well they could render stuff with with polygons instead of just textures. Uh, what kind of enemy just attacked us? Hey. You cut it out. Oh, it's him. I was like, I, I'm not fighting the same guy in a, twice in a row. That's boring. But I was trying to find him. I was like, I heard a big monster. Where is he? He's five feet away from us. Climbing up walls. But yeah, no joke. You can consistently look at, like, Silent Hill 2. It is a tad inconvenient that we can't share equipment. Let us utilize our individual strengths wherever possible. So much chatting. Like, I know it's not the graphical fidelity in a technical sense, but like, going by style and how well it sells it, Silent Hill 2 looks better than almost the entire Xbox 360 slash PS3 console generation. Like, to an astonishing degree. You're like, oh man, wow. It's wild how many, like, PS2 games look better than PS3 games. Because of, like, how poorly that specific era has aged. That's nice. We're busy. Uh, bye. I can't imagine we're in need of a campsite just now. One of us has been drenched! Ow, 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 ow. All right, I have like a, a skewering attack. Let's see. We. <laughs> what was this one again? Oh, it's the launch people in a direction move. Making fun of That's people now? Of you. Here you are. I wanted to show my appreciation. Location up. I forgot. Yeah, I picked up a throw people button. Let's practice this a little bit. Let's see. It's a little bit more dignified than what I was doing before, which which is that I would just previously I would just pick people up and be like, go over that wall. <laughs> you did it. <laughs> which is very funny, but now we can do it on purpose and not embarrassingly. I gotta remember that next time we're fighting big bads that I can throw people at the boss fights. That's handy. What is that? Statue? We ought to take a closer look. Statue? Who is Agro? They're there. You have my protection. Get off that cliff. Yay! <laughs> uh the joy of physics-based attacks. You would think that I would love, uh... you think that I would love, uh... Bulletstorm, given that kind of stuff, but a lot of the games that are sold around being able to do goofy stuff like that are usually, like, much more tedious to me. Maybe I can climb it? I think not. Maybe we go around and there's like a bomb? 
I came to know of a treasure chest in this area. Perchance you'd like to see it. Can I move? I don't think I can push this. Stop. Bad dog. Let my magic can view your weapon with the fury of the elements. What soaring through the skier? Cheer him up. Oh no, nope. cheer up too late. I'm not used to seeing that. how best to proceed it's a waterfall there we go I keep trying to use the triggers to zoom in and out uh the primary way forward is the road what is caved in so I'm kind of looking at boot to see if there's a any bombs nearby? Where did somebody just find a hundred gold? A thousand gold, I mean. How diggity. Come to think of it. Different masters, Ooh. favor different pawns. One whom I served preferred to have beastruns for allies. Words worth hearing. What? Who who would prefer to have beast men as allies? That's crazy. It's definitely destructible, right? But how? Cuz like the map has a path. Going to have to go around and see if I can just go around this hill. Now then, which way? Let us examine each path carefully before we decide. Am I back at the Minotaur Trench? I am. I have been here before. Is the Minotaur back? Pretty sure I can hear him. Ah. At least it's not a Minotaur this time, it's the it's the Sasquatch. Nope, can't climb there either. Uh I'm not sure how to reach my objective. My is yours to wield. Maybe if I found an explosive exploding barrel. This enemy likes women? What? Get on there. Fuck him up. He has not hit me yet. Nope. 
Nope. Get up on there. Please? She's not doing well. There we go. I'm not oh. I gotta move. I can't reach the head. It's in a shitty position. Woo! I'm about to get killed. Nope. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No. No eating. No eating. Oh. I did not take much damage there. Ah? Ah? Oh, he's still done. Oh, he's not done with me. Okay. Where's our, our last party members just is not here? Okay. Didn't mean didn't mean to fight another ogre this quickly, but we gotta look around. We were just kind of down a member for a while there. I don't know what they were doing. I'll put this to use. Just letting Catherine heal. Almost made it. All right, this might not have been conducive to anything. I'm trying to find how to get to my objective, but to find the false sovereign. But there's a cave in, and no one seems to comment on it in the game. Ah! Let my magics grant you an elemental boon. Graceful. How does one reach this village? Okay, this looks like a chance to climb higher. Oh, hello. What's this? This might be it. Yeah. Maybe we'll find out how to open that path from behind so it's more reasonable. Nameless village. to enter the village you best go elsewhere friend what's wrong about this place there's no business to be had here that's for sure that man just now seemed rather on edge what could he have seen here to inspire such suspicion I don't know how did he get here with the road being blocked anyway back to robbing this place blind You don't understand I needed it. It's important for my adventures. Uh huh. I 
Uh, the rotten fresh can- the rotten fresh. Okay, so all the rotten stuff can be used to make oil. That's good. The wicked remedy. Detoxifying- detoxifying is good. I'm not totally sure why we want parching concoction to be on to be honest. It makes you unwet, but I'm not sure why I'd be prioritizing that so much. You best go elsewhere, friend. What's wrong about this place? There's no business to be had here, that's for sure. Okay, but I do business. Can we do business? I would like your sluttiest armor, please. Okay. I will now steal from every building, as is my culture. Khajiit has coin if you have wares. Oh, they scattered when I approached. What you need of me? Here to ask all of me, are you? Apparently not. Apparently I can't. Please, everyone, I would like a drop of context. Is that For a starving mind. I, I reckon so. Rather more common looking than I expected. But I suppose that's neither here nor there. Just a question of skill at the end of the day. So you say, but you wagered against our visitor, did you not? And I'd do it again. Just look at that fool's face. They bet against me. What you need of me? And then I can acknowledge the fact they were just talking about me. Well met, sir. How might I be of service? So they're anticipating well me met, and expecting sir. something. How might I be of service? Bye. Daggers. Let's see, lupine bow. Let's see how these bows compare to yours. You have the bespoke. Prowl or neckerchief? Oh, ch oh chest. The neck piece. Mask. The Howling Hood. It's pretty good. It's weaker than my current one, but it's pretty good. With higher magic defense, some other bonuses. Activating fashion souls. Okay. Camping kits. The Ring of Tenacity, maximum stamina. The lupine cape. Oh. That is a full-on wolf cape. That's pretty cool. But it obscures so much because it's so bulky. Works for you though, maybe? See weapons. Yeah, nothing for my class and nothing better for his class. The mask. That's wild. Half plate armor. Rampart breaker. So this one says it's for thieves. Oh no, they can't wear it, yeah. Do we have a thief in the party? No, because you're a warrior. This is some notably titty armor. It's an armor curious. Be a little tempting. These are mostly unnoteworthy. Nope, think I'm over it. I 
admittedly don't sell much. The game kind of just throws money at you anyway. Always a pleasure. Our packs are heavier, and our purses far lighter. An investment made for safer travels can hardly be called extravagant. Now he is blithe more, honestly. <laughs> In a goofy way. That's kind of a dead end, so we'll try these houses next. Might as well just check all of them. Pray, allow me to open your chest. No, nah, you did it. Don't need your help. This letter is as suspicious as they come. We must find someone who can explain its true meaning. A suspicious letter. Greetings, child. I'm here to rob your home. Bye. No, I won't. I won't need to talk to you. Okay, fine. Me? I'm just going for a stroll. This is your house. You are not going for a stroll. You are explicitly not going for a stroll. It's extremely ah, noticeable. You must be the visitor I've heard so much about. Have you some business here in the village? Ask about the village. You would know of our village. As you can see, tis a simple place, tucked away on the eastern edge of Vermond. Is there all else I can help you with, sir? Ask about Arthur. Arthur. <laughs> tis a name unfamiliar to me, I'm afraid. At least, no one by that name lives here, sir. <laughs> As you like, sir. Happiness is a full schedule. Making our way down this road still. Hey, all. I take it you're the outsider my lord mentioned. How do you know to expect you? I couldn't tell you. Why not ask him yourself? You'll find him in the manor atop the on hill. That's exactly where I'm going. What a coincidence. Like it's some kind of designed level for me to play. If I already been in this building. No. Obviously not. You made this? I made this. This door doesn't open. Suspicious door. Gleep. Hmm. I'm not seeing a way in, but it is merged into the wall of this area, so there, a cave could lead in, potentially. I'm not seeing a stinky way in. Nope. People are always talking, and they scatter right when I approach. Hi. Greetings. I must say I'm impressed by your intuition, sir. You found me out far sooner than most. I trust you are enjoying your sojourn in our fair village. If you have any questions, ask away. I should be glad to aid you. You found me out sooner than most. What does that mean? Ask about the village. If aught about our humble village seems strange to you, that is easily explained. For it is here that thieves are instructed in the skills they require. To begin with, those who wander into the village are evaluated for their potential aptitude. Of course, you are no exception. That you stand here now is proof you were deemed a worthy candidate. Which is to say, you have my approval as the thief master. Is there aught else you care to ask? Ask what he knows of you. You're curious what I know of you? Quite a bit, I should think. 
naturally, I'm not the only one. Our village has its own network of spies and informants, you see, and your title tends to make you stand out among the rumors we collect. You're the second arisen to come to Vermont, and you've allied yourself with Captain Brandt against the Queen Regent. In response, she's... Oops, I mustn't say another word. Don't misunderstand. I'm no ally of the Queen Regent. I merely strive to maintain neutrality in political matters. Those who deal in information must ne'er align themselves with a particular power. Such is our village code. Is there aught else you'd care to ask? Ask of the false sovereign, Arthur. Arthur, you say? Hmm. I've lived in this village many a year, but I can't say I've heard of someone by that name. My apologies. Is there aught else you'd care to ask? Ask about brass. Beg pardon? Why would you ask such a thing? A letter. Oh, you've made quite the discovery. Brass means imitating someone in Thieves' Cant. This letter means to say someone's taken on such a request. Naturally, I can say nothing as to the who or what of the arrangement. I'm sure you understand. Is there aught else you'd care to ask? I take care then. You, sir, are worthy of inheriting my ultimate technique. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Once mastered, it will allow you to fell all foes, both minuscule and mighty. Take it and do with it what you will. What are you doing? We've not been given leave to rest yet. I'm well aware of that, thank you. Y'all bickering back there? That was a surreal moment where it's like, oh, time to... Yo, well, they have my ultimate technique. It's like, we've been talking for 30 seconds. Who are you? Legend Opus. A tome detailing an exceptional ability for thieves. Use it to learn Blades of the Pyre. The Addison's main pawn will also receive the same effect. But neither of us can actually do that. So I'm just going to give it to him, I guess. <clears throat> Neither of us can actually use this effect yet. Ah, I wish that the select multiple worked on other menus. Folded letter. An anonymous letter that bears the phrase, a piece of brass. That's what that was referencing. That. We still have more to learn here. Not there. Hmm. Is there aught else you'd care to ask? I take care then. History. Oh my goodness. Wait, how does this whole thing work? Always on the move, other? Whoa. I was looking for text, a text backlog of, to revisit what he said about brass. Review it for the investigation. 
But I don't think the game lets you investigate the kind of information. I dare say we could sell this for a fair amount of gold. Deeper pockets make for shallower troubles, they say. Is there aught else you'd care to ask? I take care of that. So their name is Floud. How many people have I met? Ah. Uh... Male, human, nameless, village, expensive items, and rare items is what they like. Oh, it keeps track of what they like. Wow, oh, that hair is staying the same. Oh, it's keeping track of their details. If you want to romance them, basically. Because different people like different things. Okay. Normally when people want a history, they want just to review the recent text of the game in an RPG. Just to try to review what information they might be forgetting. I'm trying to think of what else I need to do around here. And I'm worried that I might have zoned out a little bit during the brass discussion. Probably because I didn't entirely know what they were talking about, because I didn't realize they were talking about, like, the oh, the note I found talked about brass. Whoa. Let's see, maybe someone will hail me on the way back down. That person's gone. As quiet as a we, not, we don't know yet why they're betting for and against me. So this guy moved here. Why not ask my lord yourself? You'll find him in the manor atop yon hill. What you need of me? It's pointing me back up there, not down here. Ah. Have no fear, master. I'll fare all right without you for a little while. Fucking secret hole. Was she supposed to lead me here instead of disappearing? What the hell? Why was this hole so hard to find? What? That was so hard to find. Jesus. I searched so well that I found two of the secret tokens first, which are a secret collectible that's meant to be hard to see. Jesus, okay. Gonna have to edit some of this out. This is a horrible episode at the moment. Are these seesaws? Yes, they are. Oh god. No, bees. Not bees. That was frustrating, okay. I get past the seesaw point. Oh god. Pachwang. Training stuff? Let's see, we're having a normal one today. Made it after all. <laughs> Guess that means I win. Oi, you lot best pay up. 
Dear me. God damn. Okay. These old bones. So much going on. Grow weary. Oh yep. Yeah. Everyone's in here. It's all the same characters. Why'd the child disappear? You didn't disappoint, did you? You've done well. Seems only fair I answer any questions weighing on you. Come on. Ask away. These guys were Truman showing me. Ask about the decoy sovereign. Figures you'd want to know about him. Yeah, that's the entire reason I'm here. We're supposed to be neutral. Ordinarily, I wouldn't say a word about one of our jobs. But I suppose I can tell you, the situation being what is. His real name is Dara. He was one of us, once. I knew that much. But he's been exiled. We had no choice, see? After he went off to play the false arisen, we're men and women of shadow. Center stage isn't our place to stand. That's why he was cast out. He'll near be part of our village again. That all you wanted to ask? Ask about Dara. For all this, Dara was in line to become the next thief maester. But he failed. Took a massive injury to the chest during the trial. So the title fell to me. That's when he went off, saying he used the scar in his chest to pose as the Arisen. And what a scheme that turned out to be, eh? Now he gets to sit pretty on the best seat in the kingdom. I just heard thunder, I think, so here's hoping this episode doesn't suddenly cut off from a lightning strike. Still. You'd have a hard time proving that he's not who he says he is. He's a wily one, that Dara. Always was careful not to leave behind a shred of evidence. But we can't have him thinking that he gets to go off and enjoy a peaceful life in the lap of luxury after breaking our code. Methinks he needs something to remind him of the debt he owes us. Here, this should do the trick. <laughs> Bill of Arrest. Well, I mean, unless he's a very similar looking now, uh, beastman. As to the Maester's teaching, not sure you'll be able to use it to its fullest potential, but I'll show it to you. Unless he's this very specific looking beastman, I don't think I don't feel like he's going to be able to impersonate me that well. Let's say it's going to be hard to prove he's not who he says he is. I'm like, well, I'm me. People have met me before. Hmm. I've things to do if you don't mind. That all you wanted to ask? Aye. Till next time, then. So they're doing bets on whether or not I would succeed in finding this place. You're the one, then. Fie. I'd hoped I'd not be seeing you here. Dear me. How dare you! Just what I was waiting for! You've my gratitude. Whatever it is, I'll thank you to leave me out of it. You're here. I've been waiting for you. Uh huh. I'm just grateful I get to lead a Considering that some of them kind of interfered, I don't feel like that's a fair bet. The extent to which I'm stealing from the thieves seems ill-advised. This must be the secret door. Uh-huh. So this is where you were, Master. I searched high and low for you. Do take care not to stray so far next time. God damn it, she did I was right, she disappeared behind that door. It was just a ta she was taunting me. She was literally taunting me about me not finding the actual way in. I warn you, I'm not easily impressed. So she disappeared behind the one the one way door. Super rude.
bit of a trek to get back. I guess I might as well use one of the fairy stones. Oh god, I've got five now. Okay. Not bad. Well, this place can't be all bad. They gave me a wolf mask. We've arrived well enough. Where to next? Let's see. Do I still have to meet up with him at night? Well met, sir. Fancy a gander? Fine I do, wear. don't I? Welcome to the we serve all manner of fine ales here. Shall I pour? I suppose I can just pass the time. Come back any time. And then he'll just like spawn here. Yep. As a reward for your majesty's efforts, you have been invited to attend the coronation. Twould seem congratulations are in order. You will, of course, require raiment befitting of the occasion. I would ask that your majesty return once you've procured such attire. I don't want to. There is much we ought to tend to, if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim. As have you divined aught of the false sovereign, your majesty? Dara's Bill of Arrest, a bill of arrest bearing the likeness of a man named Dara. It reads, wanted for crimes against Veramund and her people. This appears to be a bill calling for the arrest of a man named Dara. But hold a moment. Does this man's countenance not bear an uncanny resemblance to that of the false sovereign? Hmm. I see. If your majesty is certain that the two are one and the same, then I am convinced as well. However, I'm afraid this paper alone does not constitute sufficient proof. Ah, but of course. I surmise your majesty intends to post the bill and invite suspicion. A clever plan. The Queen Regent will be forced to deny any connection to our new sovereign, yet will be unable to remove the bill from the public eye. Furthermore, it will serve as an attestation to Dara's existence, which shall remain an undeniable truth till the man resurfaces. And all the while, the doubts lurking in the hearts of the citizenry will continue to deepen. A clever ploy indeed. I shall attend to this matter personally. I have no doubt that this bill will prove its worth in due course. You have my gratitude, your majesty. Your aid has been invaluable. So, the false sovereign operates at the behest of Queen Regent Deesa. This spider has woven her web rather carefully. Is the word ploy still accurate when it's true? Dragon's Gaze. If you use the admin as Dragon's Gaze, Wakestone shards will be displayed on your map. Bear in mind, however, that the number and location of shards that can be found will change over time. Click three Wakestones and then become Wakestone. Alright. Uh, not usable by my, my, by my companion. Yeah, it's all thief gear. Oh, they're in town. Interesting. Did I lose it? No. This kind of always works. Okay. There is much we ought to tend to if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen. Tell me of the magistrate. A place with books likely to entice Magistrate Waldo, you say? Not springs to mind, I'm afraid. Kendrick of the Gracious Hand is versed in many things. Perchance he knows of such a place? Okay, so this is a chance to follow up on the whole place to read books quest. So I won't move on without that. So we've narrowed it down at least, someplace in the slums. 
Haven't been to the slum since I was arrested. That was like 10 hours ago. Whee! Oh, what does this say? It couldn't hurt to take a peek. A predicament. Sneaking in behind your desk again. Greetings. Welcome to the Guild Hall. Here we conduct all manner of procedures pertaining to vocations. If there is or still, still don't have any archer variations for poor Leon. Nope. Oh well. He has those already. Oh, erupting shot. An augment of exploding shot. Oh. Increases arrow speed if exploded while clinging to a target. The user pierces the target with explosive arrow directly. You can add them onto them directly. That's interesting. Oh, it automatically replaces it. Chain of Blows employs the user's momentum to unleash an additional Mighty Sweep. When using Mighty Sweep, press X the moment the blade reaches the end of its arc. Oh, and it'll keep looping. So you learn, you learn to work with the momentum. Surging Strike. Leaps up and plunges down the blade using the full force of the user's weight. Deals further strikes to smaller flinching targets. Just crunch, crunch, crunch. Oh god. Employable while jumping, most powerful when used from a height. It's a it's a, that's a proper plunging attack. Okay. Revivify gives the user a second wind, curing them of some debilitations. Caught fire, frostbite, sleep, silence, and unconscious. Hmm. It's just a level of of uh. Hmm. Fight a lot of things off. I think I might want, might want Surging Strike instead of Skyward Sunder. Except for the... Uh, don't know if I can use this to hit Harpies. I might change my mind on these abilities, but it seems re decent. He's rank six. I rank six and three. I may assist you with. Simply say the word. Have you found any of the items we discussed? All right, that's ten tokens. I need fifteen. Do come again. Nope. What's that say? Peddler's Ledger. Heard some people in the tavern talking about a shop over the rest of town. Over in the rest of town. A scrap store, they called it. Doesn't sound like much, but apparently you can have forgeries made there. Reckon the grimoire I lost all that coin on was one of them. Mayhap I could earn it back by making some forgeries of my own, selling them off to collectors. Forgeries. <gasps> my, my oil ran out. No. Um. Lantern. Okay, I've got oil. I probably don't need my lantern lit here. No, I had I had more oil. That may be the first time I've used a full lantern oil, so it just lasts a long ass time. It's not much of a concern. Good evening, sir. I trust you fared all right on the roads to spot. Let's see. More book to get rid of. 
Oh, you can see in the icon how much lantern there is. These are really full. That one's medium full. That one's almost empty. And this one's full again because I put more in it. Okay, so the icon itself tells you how far along it is. It's kind of interesting. Maybe I'll store these daggers just in case I need that specific weapon someday. Learn from past mistakes a little bit. At the hour. You know what? I don't need this many. We don't need that many camping supplies. We have at least we have more than one. You know where to find. I'm becoming mobile enough that I'll reasonably not need a second one on me at a given time, usually. Welcome to Bjorn, and quality is what you need if you want to survive. I've got more nonsensical items for you to upgrade, like this wolf helmet. It's stupid. Small thing. Yep, I got that. Freakish mane. Okay. Interesting thing to call it. Why can't I go to... So hope to see you again. I think he's just not nearby. Come on, Leon. Get your ass over here. Welcome to pure and quality is what you need if you want to. There you go. He wasn't showing up at all because I guess he wasn't close enough. One forty seven. Well, we just got everything we need there. It's up to 157. Survive. Hope to see you again. Might as well take a look while you're here. I'm sorry though. His his the the tights look like what? That's what his... <laughs> that's the gear he's got. He's got more reve revealing gear than I do. That's that's what his pants look like. God damn. Uh, I don't need to bully him with the way that I've been behaving, though. Welcome to... And quality is what you need if you want... Why is the plume cat in his inventory? Hang on a minute. No purchases to be He just wasn't wearing his cap. Did I take it off? I took the armor off for a second because it was funny. I don't remember taking the cap off. Today I see. I just hope the shopkeep understands. Gold is a resource best spent judiciously. Oh. This is a clue about the storyteller. Let me be, would you? Oh. Just kind of going on to himself. I don't think this is necessarily tied to the storyteller guy. Are they telling me to read this? Fresh fruit for sale? That's fine. So the exclamation point is just anything that they point out. And sometimes it's very hard to find. Yeah, so we're trying to make our way into the slums to find a book place. Let's follow up on that. 
Ah, uh, might as well rest at my house where I can sleep for free. What? I had a feeling you would not be here today, and yet I still set out to see you. More the fool I, no? However, I do not regret my coming here. At the very least, tis an opportunity to pass on this package, which I hope will be of some small aid to you on the road ahead. Take care, Arisen. May this letter find you in good health. A fairy stone? Had I not encountered your majesty when I did, I fear this, this nation would have been led down a false path. My gratitude to you and whatever power orchestrated our fortuitous meeting knows no bounds. I believe you are more than worthy of this token of my esteem, and I pray twill be of aid to you on the long road ahead. This one's Brant. That one was from somebody else, wasn't it? A fairy stone, damn. Shall we get some rest then? I thought it might have been notes from the person who ran this place, and then it's but then it was like talking about having missed you. I was like, uh actually is this a stalker note going after this lady? Did she, We've much to be so I briefly thought she had sent me to day. inhabit Are this place to catch her stalker. Where are you going, buddy? Hi. Got some coin to spare your humble story. What would you have made? He's sprinting. Is he just going to the place where he talks, though? Gather round, gather round. Treat your ears to it. There's a ladder here. Perhaps There's a ladder here. Discoveries await us above. It was so sad trying to even understand him the first time because, like, there's so many NPC barks you can't hear him. But then also the game will randomly be like, eh, fuck you. <laughs> Enemies attacked. But I take it that since that's my home, now various characters will just kind of send me gifts as a thank you there? Gotta go that way to get out of here. So here, then here. There it is. I see it. I was like, where's the path out of here? Is this a challenge arisen to see who can keep pace? Yeah. Let us endeavor to keep up, though we are less fleet of foot. Losers. So here's where I got arrested in the first place, where I thought I was in deep shit. Because I failed the escort mission or something. I don't know, I lost him. Never seen him since, I think. Not totes sure what might be around here. Hello. Greetings. You seek guide you need, only make a worthy offering. In it is lovely to see you. Uh so past the fortune teller leads down to the slums too. Is this a metaphor? What should I do? Oh, my pawn's just shoving them. This is generally used as a material. Of the gracious hand, do say you'll go and see her. She's your best hope. She used to conduct research into the sedatives and sleeping medicants for the army over in Bathal. So I am certain she will. I'm sure we'll find a purpose for it in due time. Why is that note so fuck it up? Alright, well I haven't been around here since the beginning. Arms, arms for the poor. Pray grant those less fortunate Well met, Sir Arisen. Might I trouble you for arms for the poor? Many thanks. May fortune smile upon you, kind sir. Just yonder looks to be a good spot for harvesting ingredients. Helping out with charity. No Hmm, I don't think I can break through that, but there is a ladder down there. I can see it. I must pray for guidance. So there is an area under there, even if I can't get to it from there. Lacking in devotion? I'm ill at you, dear. I 
and talk to that person. If he wants to read so badly, it seems like the church might have a library. Maybe. If they have a basement. At. Someone sounds ungood. Is there a zombie behind this door? I don't see a weird rectangle on the wall to indicate that a piece of the wall opens. Let's see, this is not where the tower is, this is somewhere else. So it's not under the tower. This is indicative that there might be a secret way inside. Is there aught I can assist you with? Apparently not, because whenever somebody asks that, that means there's no dialogue. Was I lacking in devotion? Is there aught I can assist you with? Mysterious well. What do you want? We're not getting in that way. I'm begging these characters not to jump in the ocean. Sir Arisen, might I trouble you for arms for the poor? Many thanks. Me ah, hold on a moment, Sir Arisen. Perchance you would be willing to aid me with another matter. You see, one of the children we care for here at the Gracious Hand has gone missing. Malcolm, his name is. He's a steady lad. I can't imagine he would have run away. This building's very old. It could be that he's found himself in some strange corner of it. Might I impose on you to search for him? Let us begin by gathering information. Okay, so Malcolm's also missing somewhere around here? <clears throat> God, ah, damn it. Quests. When in Malcolm has gone missing, ask around, see if he knows it. Okay, so this might lead to the other objective as a result. This is a place of prayer. Do keep your voice low. Okay, do give me answers. Is there aught I can assist you with? Oh god. A moment's prayer can do a world of good. Back to talking to everyone again, hoping they'll say anything to me. A moment's prayer can do a world of good. I fear I've much to attend to. Okay, so I guess just none of you are characters. Let me know if you require a guide for that quest. I have useful knowledge to impart from my travels beyond the rift. Okay. What do you have? Malcolm's been really into exploring of late. Just the other day, he was going around telling anyone who'd listen about how he was an ox hair away from making some big discovery. Leon? Is that you? Abilities 
I wonder what it was Malcolm found. Treasure? Where did these guys come from? Seems like everyone always wants something. Malcolm? All he's doing of late is picking through rubble. Don't know why he bothered. Well, then he's in there, right? Where the rubble collapsed. Game's chugging a bit around here. Oh, wait, how, how much can I climb this? Um, jump from that roof, maybe? You have wronged me, and so yourself. What? I didn't talk to you. Who are you? You have wronged me. They drew a sword vaguely in your presence, but not at you at all. That's stupid. Oh, that's slidey. I can't climb on that. I wish I could at least try to tell better whether or not there's anything to find up there on top of the broken tower. Oop. Morgues and charnel houses. If a civilian dies, their body will be brought to a mortuary within a few days of their passing. Whether the corpse ends up in Battelle's morgue or Vermin's char uh, charnel house depends on where it was found. A reason can revive the dead using a wake stone so long as they have access to the corpse. I can revive the dead? Oh. Anyone here? One wake stone shard is a mere rock. But combined, they can work miracles. We must if, take care not to throw it away by mistake. If I can revive dead people, it feels kind of wasteful to use the the shard on my on myself when I have continues. What if people need me to revive them? That makes me worried that the kid we're looking for just died and is in, and is in here somewhere and no one noticed. Because it feels like it's almost like a tutorial for saving him. Dude, these places are huge. Is it meant to be big enough to hold the entire population of the area? If I just go on a spree? It's upsetting. There's both so many uh, spots for bodies and also none here. Got this foreboding promise, essentially. Tis here that the bodies of those who fall in vermin are first kept and tended to. I beg you to conduct yourself with care and with a reverence befitting of one who walks among the dead. An unsettled mind begets an unsettled world. Your patronage is much appreciated. I'm just nervous. Is somebody here? Come to think of it, was there not another task we were to see to somewhere nearby? Efficiency is not the only factor worthy of consideration. Why did it just shout, find the jade at orbit me? Oh, hello. Ah, now here's a surprise. At least all our efforts weren't for naught. Ha! Huh? I'll have to remember to tell my own master about this. The games are like, be properly reverent and whatnot. But anyway. Why did why did it flash find the Jedi orb on my quest? We were literally just told, "Hey, there's a Je thing can call a Jedi orb." That's it. It's missing or whatever. Anyway, that was so far away from here when I got it. It's like from a different region. 
are they saying it's actually nearby or do they just randomly hint at various or they just randomly like gesture at other quests if you haven't done anything for a while I said I don't understand why I brought up j.org but I'm in the middle of a quest it's like I'm doing something else There's even more rooms around here than I thought. Alright. I don't think this is relevant to finding the kid. Such a strange call out because they're like, Wasn't there another quest nearby? And it just highlights the JIA orb, and then there's no additional context to why they said that. The person that's afraid of me. What should I do? What to do? What to do? I have no mother or father to speak of, you see. So the nice people at the gracious hand take care of me. I wanted to get them a present to say thank you, and I thought a bunch of flowers would be just the thing. Now the problem is, I can't seem to find any good ones. Do you think you could help me? All I need is a bunch of pretty flowers. For true. Thank you ever so much, Arisen. I'm sure you'll find the prettiest flowers that ever were. Hoi, Arisen! Have you brought me a bunch of flowers already? Yes. I'm oh, the flower just boy. Look at them. They're the most beautiful flowers I've ever seen. <laughs> These should brighten the sisters' days. Say, would you mind terribly if I asked you another favor? Uh-huh. See, one of my friends taught me a magic spell. It's supposed to let you meet whomever you like. All you have to do is find a silver stone, put it under your pillow, and say the magic words. But there's the problem. I've been looking all over for such a stone, and I can't find one anywhere. Would you find a silver stone and bring it to me, Arisen? Uh-huh. For true. I knew I could count on you, Arisen. I'll be waiting. Oh, I can't find a silver stone anywhere. Have you fared any better? Oh, no. They're hard to find, aren't they? Well, if you happen across one, I'll be here. You're gonna sleep like garbage with that under your, your pillow. <laughs> I think I do have it. Not what? Oh. Where could Malcolm have gotten off to? Perhaps you could try asking the other children. I haven't been able to get much out of them myself. You don't look like much. Okay. Hi, sir. Is it true you're the Arisen? That's what I've heard, anyhow. I'm quite sure I wasn't dreaming. But ox carts don't run so late at night. Was it a phantom then? I shudder to think. Was he going through the wreckage, the rubble at night, and then an ox cart came by and nabbed him up? I don't think we've been here yet. Do you know how long you'll be? I only asked so that I might adopt the most effective stance to recuperate my strength. Tis not our place to hurry the Arisen. Is this a secret passage into the jail? What is this? Rat. I'm not sure why I patrol here, but if I'm honest. Okay, yeah. Much faster secret way into the jail. Interesting. I already have a key that's permanent, too, so I don't even know what the... 
maybe it gets confiscated otherwise. It's interesting that the like the makeshift jail key is single use. Presumably, hat gets is used if you get arrested from like attacking people or something, since stealing doesn't seem to exist. And then I guess you use it once to get out of jail without paying fines or whatever other consequences there might be. Where could Malcolm have gotten off to? I wonder what it was Malcolm found. He's kind of trapped asking around. Tis good to be busy. Work begets opportunity. Let me alone. I'm not out here for fun, you know. I guess out here means the slum, because he's not outdoors. They particularly suggested looking for children. Say, I've noticed you walking around questioning people. Looking for information, are we? If yeah. I were you, I'd pay a visit to the jail next, if you haven't already. The place oh. is full of unsavory characters, as one might expect, who've seen things ordinary citizens aren't privy to. I should know. I was among their company till just recently. Okay. Let's go back to the jail then. I just figured, oh, this is me getting off track. And it's like... Where I would go once I find what that guy wants. Does he want a library or some kind of reading place? If that is your decision, <clears throat> we cannot follow. But know that your return is eagerly awaited. I'm still not one thousand percent clear on whether or not people will arrest me ever. They just introduced the idea of it, and I mean, I am like breaking in at this point. So tight. I'd hip just about anywhere. Wall looked a little weird. Hmm. Oh, looking for the Jedi orb, are you? Can't say I've seen it, or heard of it for that matter. Mind refreshing my memory. Am I being attacked? Oh no. I think I'm in trouble. It's all coming back to me now. Uh, which is to say, I've not a clue. But I can tell you what I'd do if I need to treasure like that. <laughs> Just kicking the shit out of me. My first stop would be Ibrahim's scrap store. Got to be sure my price is the genuine article, eh? The scrap stores are in the checkpoint rest town. Might be worth a look, see. Uh, I'm under attack, and I guess if they defeat you, maybe they capture you? Maybe I need to refresh it. I have been waiting for you, Arisen. Are they done? I swear this is just the jankiest, strangest part of the entire game. It was just like not being able to tell how I'm supposed to interact with these spaces where I'm out of line. Go back upstairs, please. I don't think I have any stealth buttons or skills. I'm a I'm a warrior. 
And I've got to interact with these spaces on a regular basis, and I don't. There's not even like a crouch button, so I don't know what they want from me. And they've mostly not reacted to me, but very occasionally they do. Anyway, that guy gave me a lead on the Jadeite Orb, but unless the Jadeite Orb is about the, is the same quest, then it doesn't seem relevant. Can't interact with the door for some reason. Oh, why didn't he attack me? Your best bet's the scrap store. Am I not allowed to let him out specifically? Huh? Thanks, I suppose. And he's gone. I guess they've relocked the store, which makes sense. Have you found? I suspected as much. I can't tell if the game just unrelatedly was like, go check out the uh, random other quest out of nowhere. He wants silver ore. Trying to do the cage magistrate, and I got on the path of trying to find Malcolm. But now they're like, I don't know, man, the Jadeid ore, bro. And I'm like, I can't tell the Jadeid ore is related to what I'm doing or not. Which quest is it? Scaly visitors. Uh. Check in Melv sometimes. There you go. I said look for the scrap place. But where was this? Mm. My head will roll if force goes awry. I know you made a sterner stuff than that. I'm under attack again. I think they're mad at me again. I can't tell what causes them to be mad. Is it running? Is it because I ran? Is that what stealth being turned off it was like? What would you have me? I'll have no trouble, thank you. All is lost. Some of these side quests just kind of feel kind of incomprehensible. I can't even tell if they're the same quest, or if they're hooking into each other, or if the game's just kind of like, unrelatedly being like, Aha, you've been asking around, huh? That you go to the jail. That technically didn't... Sending me to the jail technically did not imply whether it was for the kid or the Jadeite Orb. It's just I would have no reason to be looking for the Jadeite Orb here, because I have no leads on the Jadeite Orb at all. Whereas I am looking for the kid actively in the area, so you'd think it'd be about the kid, so I'm like, oh, the kid's in jail? No. Nope. This place offers a view of the sea. I imagine we would not escape a plunge into the water's depth. I guess that guy was unrelatedly giving me a lead about the Jadeite Orb. Now I need to find the scrap guy. Rejoice, my darling, for your Albert is returned. Welcome home, dear. I spend my days spinning yarns, only to come home to a wife for whose radiance I have no words. If there is a more fortunate fool in the city, I have yet to meet him. Now we're dealing with the guy, so now we've accidentally followed the guy who tells stories by the statue, so now there's like a fourth quest that's being mired up in this. I'm so, I'm so mixed up. Oh, you bold-faced flatterer! I guess I'm glad I found it, regardless. Go on, have a look. Well met! This here is the sanctuary of tipplers and merrymakers alike. 
I assume you'll be starting off with a mug of the good stuff. Keep those orders coming. This fearsome world of ours is best met with stiff drinks and cheery hearts, I say. Maybe if I buy a round, he'll be happier. Well, I ne'er. Interested in my wares? <laughs> and now everyone a common reward frustratingly so we'll now everyone likes me it, right I'm sure is that helpful listen up you lot albert king of beggars has come to quench your thirsts aye the ale's on me tonight so drink up my friends drink your fill how dare you it's on me what would you of me i'll have no trouble thank you oi there the ale flows are plenty here courtesy of yours truly hmm. so ne'er mind your coin purse drink your fill my friend i guess there's some other element of following him around i'm always willing to lend a helping hand Y'all, where is this missing kid? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I beg a moment of your time. Is it true? You're the Arisen. That's what I've heard, anyhow. Only, I seem to recall someone else boasting of being the Arisen over in the tavern about six months ago. Just be sure you play your part well, whatever the truth. The Arisen takes the crown here in Vermin, after all. A fellow Drake or two, and I reckon you'll earn the people's faith. <laughs> Good luck to you. Might not seem like much, but it tastes a treat. What does? What are you talking about? <laughs> oh, this house seems to have collapsed. Uh-huh. So can I see location names a little bit better? Okay. Walter's Tavern, Gracious Hand. Where's where's the scrap house? Shit. Did I lose track again where it was? Life's been pretty kind to me, come to think. Wish I'd been born a nobleman. Slow and steady gets the job done. What would you of me? I'll have no trouble. Well met. I assume you'll be starting off with a mug of the good stuff. Many thanks. Nope, that was not a way of keeping track of him that just made him disappear. Yeah, and this is the way back out of town. Welp. Time passes so slowly that I'm just like, am I supposed to just sit here for like 20 minutes waiting for the clock to change? Maybe he was hoping to... Maybe he was hoping to find something shiny among the rubble. Wonder if he found anything good. I just don't know how to proceed any of these quests. Okay. Where is the boy? This area is driving me crazy a little bit. I really wish I could review dialogue when that happens, just so I could double check what they said and see if I missed anything, because I'm constantly, whenever I'm confused, I just want to double check what people said and see if I could come up with a different way forward. Like, here I am, I'm like, ah, fuck, he said to go to the scrap place, okay? Where's this guy's scrap place? Ah, fuck. I'm not sure, actually. I lost track of it. 
And that's it. It's not, it's not in the quest log. It's not in, this, in the history. I can't tell if there's a hole up top or not. The end comes. I shall. Well, I, I unequipped the thing for throwing people. Why can't they throw me? Oh? Climb just a uh, spot to climb up here. <gasps> My chance. There's nothing here. Fuck. <laughs> I believed. There's so obviously a ladder under this thing. It's even on the map. But I can't crawl. Why would someone do such a thing? Just I'm, having, I'm getting frustrated right now. I'm getting pretty frustrated today with, with the quests I'm doing right now. I just I don't know how to do anything at all. It's like I got really confused in the weird thief town, which was on purpose. But now I'm like, what the? How do I do? I have like six quests that I don't know how to proceed on. See, I'm gonna Google the scrap place because I think I'm supposed to know where it is, or at least I can get a lead on it. Scrap store. It's at Checkpoint Town. Okay. It's super far away. This is why quest logs are just helpful. Because <laughs> I don't. Unless I'm going to whip out a journal and write notes about everything they say. It's just very helpful if the game can say things. Oh, there we go. Abraham Scrap Store. Well, granted, it doesn't say where it is. Oh, it does say it. Wait, this quest does have a quest. Wait, this quest does have a marker, basically. Oh, fuck. I'm just... I'm falling apart today, apparently. I'm just... I'm confused by enough other things that I'm just losing the thread there. Okay, that, well, this is irrelevant then. We're not even close to this quest. It's on a different fucking planet. Uh, yeah, this is just the slums. Unhelpful. Those are just all the other quests. As I recall, we have another matter to attend to in this domain. Perhaps we ought to go there first. What say you, Arisen? Okay, tell me how. Oh, you're gone. A short repose would do me a world of good. Is that a kid? To is, is Malcolm all right? You weren't here before. We were supposed to go exploring together. But I overslept, and he went without me. Wish he'd woken me up. I was really looking forward to going down into those vaults. Oh no, I wasn't meant to tell anyone that. We'd best report back. Okay, that's the person who had the secret. She was not there before. I don't know where she was earlier. Vault safe. Okay. Let us inform Sir Kendrick of what we've learned. Where is Sir Kendrick? I take it you've some business with this person. Then pray, follow me. Okay, where is he? Well, if you insist. I'm only glad I don't have to lead the way for a change. Uh huh. Don't I hit go for you to show me? Okay, yeah. Okay, now he's going. Oh. But does he know where he's going? Oh, he's not going anywhere. I don't understand the send people to do to t to guide you part of the game. I can't tell how it works. It's, it works sometimes, and then it doesn't work, and I can't tell the difference between why. You looking to join? Don't bother. Okay, I guess I'll just look myself. Uh, he's around here somewhere. Where's my dagger? My claws didn't even trim. 
I don't... I just don't understand how to say yes. Your character will be like... Your guys will be like, I know where to go. And then... I don't know how to tell... I don't know how to say yes. <laughs> since, since then they just don't show me. And I thought you hit go? It even glows go? Like, it's glowing go sometimes. I'm like, okay. How do I use the glowing go button? And then it doesn't... It doesn't tell me where to go. I thought that was the point of it. I thought that was the point, is to confirm that you want to them to take you to the thing that they said they just would take you to. I can still hear a voice behind there, but I can't get there. It could be the kid, for all I know. Where did the guy go? I just need to sleep till morning? I spend my days in quiet reflection. Cool. Well, he's here now, okay. Vaults, you say? By my knowledge, they were sealed off. Ah, but you mentioned rubble, aye? Then perhaps the lad found a way through. Come, I fear there's not a moment to lose. Pray, follow me, and quickly. Not much fun to be here. Okay. I can't believe this rubble's where the rubble is. <laughs> I believe this is the place to which the children were referring. I swear to God, it's the place I knew about like half an hour look ago. There, hole. Could he have passed through here? Uh huh. There is naught to be done but have a look for ourselves. The passage ahead looks small, but we may be able to squeeze through. Uh huh. Let us make haste. I know. I tried. It won't let me. Okay. Cool. Okay. Fine. Okay, we can do it now. Goofy ass I quest. I some of the soldiers standing guard outside the palace discussing a curious rumor. Regarding the Queen Regent and an important personage, you mean? Aye. Tell us, her ties to this figure from the neighboring country have a romantic tint. That's a little scary. Can I make this jump? I'm not sure I can. Yes, I can. Hmm. Ah. Welcome. Thank goodness you are unharmed. You have my eternal gratitude, Sir Arisen. Now I can breathe freely at last. Sir Kendrick, you'll never believe what I've found. It's just up ahead. Books, sir. Books, books, and more books. It's like some sort of secret workshop. Truly, perhaps we ought to take a look. And this quest hooks into Let the other quest. To keep okay. Our guide. There's no great shock to me. This door opens now. Guess not. How are we to get through this door? He is now just guiding me. Oh, spider. Big spider. Oh. Let my magic Ow! View your weapon with the fury of the elements. Wait, did the spiders attack us? Ah, ah, camera. Am I even capable of swinging at spiders? There we go. As planned. Everyone's gonna be having a lot of trouble hitting these guys, except the archer. They're poor melee weapons. Over here. Heavens above. Isn't it amazing? And I found it. Me. Tis quite a find indeed. Is this some manner of archive? Why, I've ne'er seen so many books. This collection must be worth a fortune. Tis a veritable treasure trove of wisdom. Veritable dervish. Might I ask that you not share the existence of this place with others, Sir Arisen? I know one person I will. We cannot allow the knowledge accumulated here to be misused or mistreated. 
We ought to entrust its care to someone worthy, someone who can appreciate its true value. Pray someone tell sitting me in the jail. Know of such an individual. As for you, Malcolm, I forbid you from telling anyone else about this place. It will be our little secret. Understood? Oh, but. However, in exchange for your silence, you may come and go as you please. Let's investigate this place's secrets together, eh? Tis quite a collection of tomes. I'm sure I'd be seeing stars, were I the scholarly sort. True enough. Igneous melody. Like the rocks. Yeah, this should make this should definitely make him happy. Uh, this is a wrap up of a few different quests. Okay, so we got that. Water is now invisible in this gloom. No few times has an overconfident step soaked my boots. I expect that's a common occurrence in our line of work. Overconfidence is a slow and insidious foot soaker. This place is amazing. I knew I'd find something down here. But I never expected this. The books ne'er seem to end. Who could have brought them here, I wonder? Well, I know exactly who to talk to now. Hopefully we took out all the evil spiders that will just murder that guy dead the moment he gets here. Those were a little alarming. I was content to just ignore all the giant spiders, but then our characters went in full battle craze mode. Can I break it? Oh, you break it. There you go. Hey, rats. They're so big. One of the kind of off-putting things about rats as pets is just that it feels like you're more likely to, like, injure them. So if a rat was a giant dog-sized rat, I'd be like, damn. This guy's great. I guess it's like the rats that they use to hunt for mines. In, in old battlefields. I could swear I've seen what's needed here amidst what we have in storage. We shall wait here till your business is done. They're reflecting the fact that in the storage I've got the silver that I, the other that the girl needs. That's not our priority, young sir. Like it or not, so tired. I've been to take my boots. Well, have you found some place I might sate my scholarly curiosity? Oh, to think such a place existed. Oh, very curious. Guide me outside, then. If you can deliver me from this pit, I ought to be able to find the rest of the way on my own. All right, here we go. <laughs> I'm carrying the man away. I am stealing your prisoner. I am fireman carrying this tiny man with my giant arm. Me and who, am I right? <laughs> Just... Just yoink! <laughs> Just immediate. Oh God! Why? I didn't throw him. Why did that happen? Is it him struggling until he falls out. I, this should be far enough. My thanks. If you truly are arisen. Then I swear to someday repay this debt I owe. Words may be wind, but there's naught else I can offer you at present. Pray visit me if you've the time or inclination. Mayhap the knowledge I've gained reading tomes of Eld could be of some use to you. Okay, we're good. Why did he... Why did he struggle so much that I literally... He got like auto-thrown. That was upsetting. <laughs> it's like this old man got fucked up. <laughs> I was helping him. Living Jesus. Trouble, I'm sorry. 
All right. We will now go back into town. I will grab a piece of silver for the girl while telling Brant that I, in fact, did get the magistrate to move on. Welcome to the stop we serve. The frame rate's definitely chugging, but I am just like sprinting through. Pour you a cup to... Always a pleasure. Didn't pass the time good enough. Welcome to the we serve all manner of fine ales here. Always a pleasure. She, look, she looks very annoyed at me. There is much we ought to tend to if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen. Tell me of the magistrate and tell me of the masquerade. I almost mix those ones up. It seems Magistrate Wardor has been safely delivered from his cell. The man's dedication to justice shall doubtless be a great boon to our cause. Mayhap it would be prudent to visit the man on occasion and avail yourself of his vast stores of wisdom. He might have knowledge that could benefit you on your travels. Now, would you be so kind as to return the key I lent you? No, I don't want to. I thank you. Pray. Take this. Consider it remuneration for your majesty's efforts. Another that fairy stone. That was certainly worthwhile. An achievement to be proud of. Our efforts have been rewarded. Is he here in the middle of the day? It looks like he is. No, I need to get back to my storage place and also my This ladder home? can take us to new heights. We this also ladder can take use. us to new heights. Well met. You will soon forget the fatigue of a long journey when treated to the foremost hospitality in... I'll take one silver ore, please. All Vernworth... Much obliged. Let's see, am I right or wrong that the... Let's, let's check. Does the game interfere with... Oops. Does the game interact with my stash? we've arrived. Welcome to Bjorn. And quality is what you need if you want to survive. It's equipment. Monster Fang. Astrocyte. This three out of one. Okay, let's, now let's check my inventory. Items. We're in the upgrade menu. Spider. Okay, sorry. It doesn't. Okay, it does check my stash. That's good. Because I do not have monster fangs on me. Where is my home again? All the way over here. Mildred's dwelling. Nothing has changed here at the moment. I don't really necessarily want to sleep there. Must return to child. Is that her? Oh, I can't find a silver stone anywhere. It's easy. Oh, just look how it shines. Thank you ever so much. Say, aren't you curious who I want to meet? Well, I'll tell you. My mother and father. I don't even know what they look like, you know. Not to say I'm unhappy at the gracious hand, of course. But I'd really like to meet them. Even just once. I want to tell them how grateful I am that they gave me life. Oh, it's so shiny. Oh, hi, Arisen. You'll help me again if I need it, won't you? Please say yes. Oh, it's so shiny. No. Oh, it's so... Please say yes, but there is no actual yes yet. I'll return in a few days' time. So that's on pause for now. 
Oh, it's not right. It uh. doesn't make any sort of sense. Now what's happening? The doctor examined him afore and said he'd be better with a bit of medicine. Yet ere since he came here, he's only gotten worse. I understand how you must feel. But you must see that your son's health continues to wane. There is no medicine that can heal him outright. He requires proper treatment. I am caring for him as best I can. I beg only for your patience. However, if you truly cannot entrust him to me, perhaps you would care to take him home with you instead. Mayhap convalescing in a place familiar to him would aid his recovery. Of course, I would be sure to visit him as oft as I am able. Uh, home, you say? Dear, we are pressed enough as tis. All right, he stays. But pray, bring my son back to health. I will look after him. I swear it. Was there a Beast Wren kid in there? Maybe they're the one that's locked away. I guess that could be their son. I don't know how old their son is. Or there might be the weird moaning voice that's locked away. This is a place of prayer. Do keep your voice low. I know. It's a secret, right? Oh god. Don't worry. I won't tell anyone about the old man either. I was like, why is he speaking with Malcolm's voice? Ne'er in my wildest dreams could I have imagined it would be the magistrate you called here. Not that I'm complaining. Pray, be let liberty to come and go as you please. Okay. Maybe I'll do just that. As a final thing for this episode, let's actually check in on him. So I don't lose track of this between things. Normal jump. In moments like that, I don't press Danger jump. Might lurk anywhere. Wear every shadow and mind the ceiling. Naught can threaten us if we watch each other's backs. In this game, your character's just very ready to go on some Assassin's Creed style autopilot stuff where you're like, oh my god, look at him go. He's ready to platform for me. In a, a historic account, chapter 4, tensions twixt Vermund and Batal reached their peak 40 years ago. When both nations were devastated by a prolonged bout of bad weather that resulted in successive crop failures, hard times turned the starving populaces against one another, eventually culminating in a desperate clash of several hundred soldiers, though it produced no victors, resulting in only more meaningless deaths. Upon the site of this battle now stands a cenotaph, in memory of the fallen. There you are. With the aid of Sir Kendrick and his helper in locating certain documents, I believe I finally grasped the true nature of this place. It was a royal library that was sealed off by a sovereign of some generations past. In a bid to pass the throne on to his own descendants, this sovereign attempted to consign our kingdom's histories to oblivion. Alas, it would seem that, no matter the age, the avarice of those in power is all but guaranteed. Yet, tis clear it serves them not. Almost laughably so. The Sovereign's line ultimately fell to ruin, and now this library, so laboriously sealed, has been discovered. What can we learn from this? Those who make light of history are doomed to be crushed under its heel. Fine timing, sir. Fine timing indeed. I've need of your services, you see. My time in that tenebrous jail has only hastened the deterioration of my eyesight. I stare at the page, but the letters stubbornly refuse to take shape. Yet these old eyes might serve some use if only I could wear the spectacles I had specially made. Alas, they were confiscated at the time of my imprisonment. As I recall, Prisoners' possessions are held within the palace storeroom. It is a place to which few have lawful access, as I'm sure you can imagine. Though, as I hear it, masquerades are being held of late. Masquerades with a 
great many attendees, if you catch my meaning. Should you happen to enter the venue, mayhap you would find an opportunity to liberate my poor spectacles? What say you? Would you consider doing an old man a favor? I am in your debt. With those spectacles in hand, I might actually get through one of my tomes. Pray, infiltrate the venue and find the storeroom. You are my only hope. <laughs> it's not fair. I had time. I had time. It's not fair. <laughs> 